guys, good morning, happy Friday, and welcome to another vlog. If you are new, hi. There is actually quite a few new, you know, subscribers and people on my channel. So my name is Kayla Jukic, welcome. I am so happy to have you here. I have been literally having a week. When I tell you it's been a week, it's been a week. The first thing was, it was that time of the month for me. So if you're a girl, you just know. The amount of crying I did, I was just so emotional, I wasn't feeling well, I was super bloated. So I am glad that is finally over. Plus on top of that, I did have a really stressful work week. I have a lot of like changes going on. I know I don't talk about my business too much just because I like to keep that super, you know, professional and away from like social media, but there's some like changes, you know, coming up in the near future. They're good changes, but for the time being right now, it's just like really stressful and a lot. So this week was a lot and I'm happy that it's Friday and it's the weekend. So I kind of just want to take you through my day because I have a few things to do. So right now it is actually 9.46 and I have the dentist in 14 minutes. I shouldn't even be putting chapstick on because she, like she's going to be going in my mouth, but my lips are just so dry right now. I'm just going for a regular teeth cleaning. I go every six months. So the last time I went would have been like September or October. So yeah, it's been six months now and I freaking absolutely love my dental hygienist. She is such a little cutie and we always have so much fun talking. And last time I saw her, she was getting married like in November, so like a month or two later. So I'm excited to like catch up with her about that. I just put this sweater on from Muscle Nation. I love that it's just so big and cozy and it does have a little zipper. So like if you wanna make it like a full on turtleneck type of thing, you totally can. And just like sitting in the dentist chair, I don't know, it always gets so cold. So I wanna be warm. It's gonna take me like 10 minutes to drive. So we gotta get going. Ooh, oh my God, I'm so tired. I got so sleepy because I was like sitting in the dentist chair for like an hour but i just finished up teeth are fully cleaned and polished they're looking good she literally just mentioned the back like the top back i just need to focus a little bit more on when i'm like flossing but other than that she's everything looked good she had to do some x-rays again i think i have to do the x-rays once a year so i was due for them anyways but i do have to come back on monday which i'm a little bit annoyed about because I have a cavity on my bottom left. It's not something new. They actually found it in 2021, but it wasn't bad, but now it's starting to create a hole. So I booked an appointment for Monday. That's the earliest I can come, which is crazy because today's Friday. So I'm literally coming back on the next business day. But anyways, so I have to come back on Monday and get that filled. I'm so glad my husband has benefits because it was honestly pretty expensive. So with the cleaning, with the polishing and the x-rays, $328 my god that's literally crazy anyways i am gonna head home now i want to work out i don't know why i'm not in the mood to like go to my actual gym so i think i might just go work out in my condo gym i'm gonna decide when i get home it's a little bit later now it is actually 12 20. i just spent the last hour i was figuring out some work things i had some emails to send and that type of stuff and then i talked to my dad on the phone for like 30 minutes just catching up with him since it's a little bit later i just decided i'm gonna go hit the gym in my condo for a little leg workout i quickly want to show you guys my outfit i'm wearing full muscle nation you guys know i absolutely love them and love working with them my sports bra is the demi bralette in white so it's just like a typical sports bra it has obviously a little bit more cleavage it has like this little ruching in the front and that's kind of what the back looks like it's just like open and the waistband like crosses over in the middle with that like same little ruching type of thing and then my shorts are the zero rise everyday midway short in the color bondi blue this color I think the camera doesn't even do justice like this color is honestly phenomenal it just so, it stands out so nicely as always if you do want to shop muscle nation please use my code kd at checkout k-a-y-d it saves you 10 percent off of your order and it does support me working with the brand i'm just gonna fill my simple modern tumbler to bring with me for water i freaking love this thing i feel like i talk about it all the time but it's 40 ounces it's so big it gets skinny towards the bottom so it fits in cup holders in the car i just absolutely love it people always talk about stanley's that like they leak and whatever i don't have any issues with that it has a straw i just i love this so much and of course i can carry it like this with me to the gym i'm also gonna bring my airpod maxes to listen to music and then just one resistance band because i'm doing legs and my condo gym doesn't have like a whole lot of equipment so this will help me i'm 
same circle that pretended Keep on smiling in my tiny bubble Like a movie without ending Spending time like it was going backwards I just took a body shower and I'm freaking starving. I'm eating lunch way later than I usually eat lunch. It is literally 1.50 right now, but I had a really good workout as you guys saw. I think there was one exercise I didn't record and that's because uh, like three or four people came in the gym and I was like, okay, I'm not gonna record anymore. So the only one I didn't record was single leg RDLs. Then I walked on the treadmill for 20 minutes, got some steps in just because tonight I'm going to my mother-in-law's house. So I'm like really trying to be on top of my step goal, which is 8,000 steps per day. And before I got to the gym, I was like at 2,900. So I walked for 20 minutes. I got a good amount of steps in so I'm feeling great now, but I'm freaking starving So I'm gonna show you what I've been absolutely loving lately I have been just like rotating this meal like every other week pretty much and it's a high protein sandwich So let's make it so you're gonna need sourdough bread. I use this one from Rudolph's We're gonna need some turkey slices and a slice of cheese some lettuce for veggies pretty high in fat But I just love mayo. So we're gonna put that on it and last but not least some tomato first we're gonna start off by toasting the bread I do it kind of lightly just because it does get hard and crunchy and uh, a couple of weeks ago I literally like cut my mouth because it was too crunchy so i've learned i love using sourdough bread just because it's a little bit more healthy for you it's easier on the gut to digest and it has eight grams of protein in two slices again mayo is not the most healthy choice but i don't track my food anymore and i just love mayo so i'm gonna put it on if you're in a calorie deficit you could definitely use something else if you'd like then we're gonna add some lettuce i already washed it and i'm just going to place that on i'm also gonna add a slice of craft cheese on Honestly, my husband yells at me because this is not the best cheese because it's kind of processed. But this is all I have right now, so I am just gonna use it with a couple slices of tomato. And then I'm using these turkey slices from Pillar. In three slices, you're getting one gram of fat and 11 grams of protein. So I like using six slices and getting 22 grams of protein. So all together with the bread, I am getting 30 grams of protein. I'm just gonna cut that in half so it's easier to eat. And voila, look at that. Oh my God, it's so good. First bite, best bite. It's literally so good. Honestly, until a couple of weeks ago when I started making this, I did not have a sandwich, at least a sandwich that I made personally for like probably years. Like I'm not even kidding you. I've been meal prepping my lunches for quite some time, but I'm still off of work for the winter. So I was just thinking about like new lunch ideas and I was like, I'm gonna make a freaking sandwich. And here I am a couple weeks later, I'm still on the sandwich kick. Literally Kobe is right at my feet, just staring at me. You want some? He's so cute. I just got in from walking Mr. Kobe and security had two packages for me. They're from Amazon. So we're gonna quickly open them together. So first item, what is this? Oh yeah. So I bought a bunch of things for my camera because uh, Alan and I are going on a cruise in a few weeks and I just honestly want better audio when it comes to like content creation and when I'm recording and that type of stuff. Why can't I get this open? So the first thing I bought is like this little mount. I can't show you obviously because I'm using my camera right now, but right now I'm using my Canon G7X Mark II and there's no like appropriate spot for a microphone on it. So what I gathered from online is you need to buy this sort of attachment and you put it at the bottom and then you buy a mic and put it on the side. I'll show you in a second what I mean because the rest of it is obviously in the second package, which I'm gonna open. This is the mic that I purchased. So it had really good reviews on Amazon and people were recommending this. So this is 
from Movo, M-O-V-O. This is the microphone itself. It also does come with this like big muff, which is like a windscreen. With the bottom piece, I'm gonna put the camera here. The camera's gonna sit here, and then the mic will sit on the side. So it's gonna be a little bit big, but it's fine. Then the other thing I bought are these Grace and Stella eye masks. I know I complain about this all the time in my vlogs, but the bags under my eyes are so bad no matter what I do. Like, I don't know if it's just my age, if it's stress, I have no idea. So I decided to buy these gold eye masks. This is what they look like and honestly, I'm so excited. The motto of this is it's like an energy drink for your eyes and that's definitely what I need. Not only is it energizing, it is also anti-wrinkle. So again, I'm getting older, I'm 31, so that's what I need. In this pack, it comes with 24 pairs, so I'm gonna definitely try it out and see how it goes. I'm sure you guys are gonna see this in other vlogs. I'm just gonna be like walking around wearing it. And then the last thing I bought is another simple modern tumbler. This is 32 ounces. I bought the white one, and I really like it just because it does have like a little straw, so that's good. It also did come with a second lid that looks like this. So it doesn't have a straw, but instead of taking the whole top off, you just, you know, open this part up and then you can drink so I thought that was very cool and I appreciated that so this is gonna be good I like that it has a little handle so yeah that is everything that I just bought from Amazon I already have other things in my cart oh my god I'm so bad when it comes to Amazon but there is a few more things that I need which I will probably buy this weekend. I honestly want to put one of those eye masks on right now, but I will wait. Maybe I'll, it will be like a Sunday thing. Like I'll do an, a face mask and then my eye mask or whatever. But I can't do it right now just because I have some mascara on and you're not supposed to wear makeup. But anyways, it is four o'clock now. Alan usually finishes work at like 4.35, so he should be home soon. And tonight we are actually spending the night at his mom's house, so my mother-in-law's house. And also tomorrow is an F1 race and our family, like we love Love F1, so we kind of just want to like watch it all together. So we're gonna stay there tonight. That means I need to pack a bag. So we are gonna go do that right now. First things first, I need a bag. And honestly, I have them all shoved in here. I'm gonna grab my like weekender bag dupe. I don't know why my room is so dark. So I'm gonna do everything out here so you guys can see everything I pack. It's from X. Etronic, I guess that's how you say it. It's from Amazon. I can link it below for you guys if you want, but it's literally the exact same thing. Like it has all of the straps and space. It even has this like bottom section for shoes and all of the good stuff. So I'm not gonna need much clothes. I just need my pajamas. I have one outfit for tomorrow. It's my matching set from Amazon. Love it. Some socks and underwear. I'm also gonna bring my book. Currently reading Ugly Love by Colleen Hoover. I also absolutely love this. I got this in a FabFitFun box last year. It helps you sleep, but I'm almost out of it as you can see. I'm gonna have to buy a new one soon. Gonna add that to the pile. I'm not gonna bring my makeup. I just have it sitting here, but I'm gonna bring all of my morning and nighttime skincare. This is literally everything. I don't know how, but I'm gonna have to fit it in this little thing somehow. And then of course I'm gonna grab my brush and my toothbrush and toothpaste. Oh yeah, and also my bubble headband. I love these things. They're so cute. So that is the bag of my skincare, the bubble headband. I decided I'm gonna bring this comb instead of my brush just because it's smaller, and then deodorant. Honestly, I don't think I need much else. Like I said, we're just going for the night. I'm gonna also bring my laptop and charger, which I'm not gonna put in the bag right now, just because we're not leaving for another like two hours probably. Like I'm gonna have to see, because we wanna leave after traffic, because it's a Friday and we're going to Brampton, which is a shit show. So I wanna use my laptop in the meantime, but I'm pretty sure like that's all I need, so I'm gonna pack it away. Mm -hmm. 